What's up, everybody, and welcome to this update on BioS3 Raw TV. Now, my buddy, who Laz R, who I just made the video and I read something about the Ice Cream Fitness and Lane Norton battle, had, was actually nice enough to resend me another one saying that I probably had missed inside that thread. There's a, um, a guy, I think it's William Quinn or whoever it is, but he was talking late about me. It does say BIOS 3, so that's pretty cool that they're talking about me. Whatever. Anyways, Lane just prayed, straight up says that I'm a joke. I'm a joke. Why, Lane? Because I asked you to not be a dick and not lie about what yet you didn't know what clean foods were. That's why I'm a joke. Am I a joke because I question your natural status? Newsflash, Lane, a lot of people question your status, not just me, and they have for a long fucking time. And I'm not the guy who sits there and like this. And then my research on leucine, which was the most boring phase ever, but to me it was very exciting because I don't sit there like that. I'm a joke, Lane, because I don't talk about having my PhD and throw that in everybody's face. I never went after your research. I never went after your products. I never went after anything except you being a bullshitter about how you didn't know what clean foods were. And yes, I don't think you're natural. I'll go out there and put it out there now, okay? I'm not going to pull any more punches because you think I'm a joke. Fuck that. I don't think you were clean when you did those shows. I absolutely don't. Can I prove it? No, but it's my opinion and I'm entitled to my opinion. You know what? There's a lot of other opinions like mine. So although you may have... Lane's army or Norton's army or whatever, BIOS 3 has its own following too. And you know what? A lot of them don't think you're natural either. So you guys can argue and piss and moan and call me a joke. That's fine. But the bottom line is you're still talking about me on your Facebook page. You're talking about ice cream fitness on your Facebook page. So you guys are still talking about us. If we were so insignificant, you wouldn't be talking about us. The problem is you feel threatened, Lane. You can't stand by and let other people have their opinions on you and question you because you're Mr. PhD. PhD doesn't mean shit. You're still a human being like everyone else. And you know what? We deserve the right to question what you have to say. We deserve the right to have to have you prove stuff that you are saying is true because you're the one out there saying it. So as long as we keep our mouth shut, everything is fine. If we asked for you to say, you know what? Prove what you're saying. We're a joke. We're an asshole. We're this. Well, you know what? That snake oil that was sold back in like the 1930s, nobody questioned that until they questioned it. And then they realized it was bullshit. So maybe there's a little bit of that snake oil thing going on here. Maybe you feel threatened by us, so therefore you have to call us a joke, etc., etc. When all we did was basically go out there and say, we don't agree with what you're saying. I'm not calling you a joke. Didn't call you anything. Well, yeah, that's not true. I called you a dick. I said, don't be a dick because you know what clean foods are. Okay, bottom line was, you can't even argue that because you sat there in your chair. There's no real definition of a clean food because every time I ask someone to explain it, their argument breaks down ridiculously fast. Give me a fucking break. Bottom line is, like, keep talking shit. Go for it because the more that you talk about us, the more people are going to wonder because I saw it on your Facebook thing. Your own Facebook, people are starting to question you, Lane. So you always have the ones that don't question you and blindly will follow you. I want people to question me. I want them to ask why. I want them to ask me to prove things. I don't want to argue with them about how I'm right and they're not. I want them to open their minds and use their brains and be independent. Real people, not sheep like Lane's army. Biosutraining at gmail.com. The comments down below. www.biosutraining.com is the blog. And Lane, I'll see you later. Ouch.